Hi, welcome to Mary's Math Club. Binary composition laws or laws on binary composition we will discuss today. But what is binary composition? Suppose there is a set of the elements um, A, B, C, D and lots of and if the operation we do on the elements of this set and the unique result we get which result also belongs into this set then we say this is a binary opposition operations and the com binary composition law here we discuss so what is binary composition if a set a then any mapping of a cross a into a is called a binary composition on the set a now we will discuss here laws of binary composition first associative laws what is associative laws associative laws means if there is three elements not that the set will be only with three elements but at least three elements is needed for the associative laws suppose element a b c these elements are belongs into the set s so according to the associative law we will say the operation we will say the operation uh, i am giving this sign to indicate operation this sign this operation is associative if and only if we get that a asterisk means this operation b asterisk c again equal to a asterisk sign b and asterisk sign c look at here so in the case of associative law at least three elements are needed and the one operation is needed the same operation we are using twice it that we have grouped first we group with b and c and then we associate it with a and here just other things we did here we did grouping with a and b between a and b and then we associated that with c so if it satisfied only then we can say that yes this operation this operation which i uh, has indicated here the operation which i have indicated with this asterisk sign this operation is associative on the set of this now with an example we will make it more clear our set is set of integers we are denoting by like this set of integers is a set of integers means all integers positive and negative neutral all and we have to prove that this on the set of these integers whether multiplication is associative or not associative or not so our operation is here multiplication this is our operation here binary operation now z is a set of integers so we can take any element of this set uh, set so suppose i am taking uh, the elements 3 uh, minus 5 and 7 so now according to associative law i have to prove that 3 compulsory operation binary opposition is here multiplication then i am making the grouping minus 5 I am using brace here. Again the same operation. 
मल्टीप्लीकेशन एंड एल सो इफ दिस इज इक्वल टू थ्री एम गिविंग ब्रेस हियर माइनस फाइव बिकॉज आई हैव टू चेंज द ग्रुपिंग आई हैव टू रीग्रुपिंग सेवन इफ दिस इज means the left hand side of the statement is equal to the right hand side of the statement on the day we can say that this multiplication operation is associative on the set instead of integer that is z so how we will check first we will take lhs means left hand side i am checking i don't know whether it is now associative or not it will be equal to or not because if it is equal to only then we can say this is associative the uh, law is satisfying here of when the operation is multiplication so to do this i am checking first a left hand side so left hand side is some erasing right now because i have to write whether equal to or not equal to 3 into minus 5 into 7 means minus 35 okay then equal to minus 105 this is left hand side this side means this is the result of this side now rhs means this side right hand side see rhs is giving 3 into minus 5 it means minus 15 multiplication 7 is going to giving us minus as it is minus so 105 so both the cases it is equal minus 105 and that's why we can say that this one is equal to this one so in that case we will write equal to sign so left hand side of this is equal to right hand side that means this on this uh, set of integers this operation multiplication is associative if uh the case is like that that it is not uh, showing the same result then we will say it is not associative the operation on this set is not at all associative like share and subscribe my is matlab bye